Well, Sarah, this Thursday is going to bring fairly seasonal conditions for the Wasatch Front. Meanwhile, we're going to still be on the warmer side a little bit farther down south, but our weather headlines, they include hazy skies. We're going to get more wildfire smoke today, leading to moderate air quality for a lot of spots, especially along the Wasatch Front. We're going to be mostly dry, but an isolated shower can't be ruled out in some of the higher terrain for today. We'll be trending warmer heading into this upcoming weekend with temperatures going back to above seasonal averages. But a cool down by the middle stages of next week looks like it might be in sight. We'll talk about that coming up in just a little bit, but we'll start with this view from Alta. That is beautiful. We got some twinkling stars in behind the cirrus clouds. So got some pretty skies out there this morning and the cloud coverage along with the haze is probably going to create a pretty nice sunrise. Won't look all that great by this afternoon, but this morning should be beautiful and it's also fairly comfortable outside across the Beehive State. Well, we're sitting at 42 degrees in Logan, so definitely a sweater as you're heading out the door. But right on the verge of sweater weather if you're in Ogden, Salt Lake City, and Provo, with a temperature right now sitting at 54 degrees. And in St. George, very comfortable at 60. So on the bigger picture of things with the satellite and radar, you can definitely tell that there are clouds working their way through the Beehive State. There's a little bit of light rain on the northern side of Utah, right into the southeastern half of Idaho as a system is working its way in. Some of that rain might not actually be reaching the ground, but it just goes to show that as we go through today with this low pressure moving through, an isolated shower will be a possibility in the higher terrain because as you get farther down in those lower elevations, there's really just not enough moisture for that low pressure to work with, but that low pressure is also helping increase those westerly winds, which is dragging more wildfire smoke into our area. And you're really going to notice it today in the southern half of the state. Meanwhile, we'll be looking at hazy conditions across the central and northern half of the state. For daytime highs in the central and northern half of the state, temperatures will be close to seasonal averages, 78 degrees in Provo, 77 degrees in Salt Lake City, 77 degrees in Wendover, and you'll notice slightly warmer temperatures as you go down south. Very comfortable in Cedar City with a high of 79 degrees with hazy skies. We'll go with a high of 86 degrees in Moab and 93 degrees for those of you down in St. George. So as we begin the watching your weather for you, our winds are going to be out of the west today as we get that system moving through before they switch more out of the north, but an isolated shower, a possibility in those higher terrain spots during the early stages of the afternoon. But by tomorrow, the chance of any rain comes to an end across the entirety of the state as those winds become a little bit more northerly. And then for tomorrow, we're going to be looking at slightly above average warmth with a little bit more of that haze continuing. And then into Saturday, that westerly flow is likely going to result in more wildfire smoke moving in. And this westerly flow will also result in some slightly warmer temperatures as well. I'm thinking by the time we get into your Saturday and your Sunday, those daytime highs along the Wasatch Front are going to be in the lower to middle 80s. Meanwhile, for those of you that down in St. George, your temperatures are going to be very consistent over the next several days with lower to middle 90s continuing with a mostly sunny to partly cloudy sky each day. But for today and tomorrow, we will have those hazy conditions and it will be breezy today as well as overnight lows will settle more so into the middle 60s. But a cool down could be on the way by next Wednesday with temperatures dropping into the middle 80s along the Wasatch Front middle to upper 70s for today. Breezy, partly cloudy tomorrow, a little bit more sunshine with the daytime high is closer to 79 degrees than lower to middle 80s for your Saturday and Sunday, more so middle 80s for your Monday. But it look towards next Wednesday. There will be at least an isolated chance for some rain as those temperatures could be dropping back, back from the 80s into the 60s. So a cool down does look like it might be on the way for the middle stages of next week. We'll keep you posted on that.